Good afternoon, my good friends, and uh, good afternoon to all of you from all over the world in the United States. Uh, Today's newsletter is kind of a little bit depressing in so many ways, uh, but uh, you know this is how it is. So if you are obviously uh, following my work is because you are not only entertained, but you are also learning a few things along the way. And that is called Building Up Your Cosmic Consciousness. The title, uh, Talking Kitty Cat Stars Steve Cash Suicide Explained, um, is definitely eye-catching, but also uh, deep. There is deep information that I will divulge, divulge to you as we proceed. Uh, first thing again, I want to thank the director and the producers of uh, the UFO movies that you can watch. Just go to the newsletter, click on the link, it's live. Uh, go there uh, and of course uh, uh, write to this documentary. Uh, the other one where I'm featured will be uh, coming out soon. And then I'm sure many of you will really, really uh, see and appreciate uh, where I'm coming from and uh, maybe get a better idea to what my UFO Cosmic Code legacy is all about. So that is uh, coming your way. Uh, what else do we have today? The you know, normal people is, you know, normal people that are everywhere. They are either very religious or scientists, atheists, God knows what. People from all walks of life, 99.9% of you may have a, a difficulties or understanding my work, even though that I use quatrain and very obvious keywords. Uh, there is a lot, a lot of you out there that uh, uh, many of you said enough, do not read enough or do not concentrate in reading and try to understand where I'm coming from uh, using an astronomy 16th century divine astrology. So this is why it's critical for you to always go back to uh, the previous newsletter that I wrote because the news don't stop coming. So I add those news that you may not have seen before. And at the end of it, you have the keyword, shocking, surprise, uh, mind boggling, God knows what. So that is how we're gonna start today. So I always told you these windows we are produce earthquakes at or above 6.0. This window last few days has produced three earthquakes. A one, a 6.1, a 6.6, and I believe yesterday a 6.3. Now you are talking about magnitude, magnitude earthquakes that are not happening every day. And if you keep an eye, you will realize that those uh, earthquakes, for some reasons, always happen during my windows. Windows can last anything from um, two or three days. Uh, and then we are right now moving out of the shocking window. Uh, and I will tell you a little bit more later on why we are moving out of this window and getting into the plutonic window. Good luck to you. Be careful what you say, what you do, where you go, because that's where the reptilians are having fun. So let's look at the news. Gunman kills 18 in Nova Scotia in Canada, deadly shooting. Now you understand why we are moving from the shocking to the deadliest window of all, a plutonic window. So the cops, if you're a cop, if you're working in the security, if you're working at night, be careful. Fool, because this is not a normal window as far as you are concerned. Okay, so death, drama, crazy people, killing people. How many times I have said that, and the next thing you know, bingo, Dr. Therese is right again, a lunatic go and kill everybody. Here you go. I didn't post the window, but I'm just telling you, we are moving into the plutonic window. If you want to have the details. All our VIPs and all our Patreon already knows that we are moved into the Plutonic window. So let's see what type of shocking news we have here. Uh, apart from this crazy killing lunatic person who destroyed the life of 18 people. A man goes to, okay, we talked about this again. 
a man goes to withdraw uh, $1,700, and next thing he knows, he got a, res a receipt of $8.2 million. If that is not a surprise, I don't know what is a surprise. What else do we have? Pastors defend the congregating to donate stimulus check. If that is not shocking, I don't know what is shocking. To actually go there knowing that you don't have a work, you are forced by uh, coronavirus to stay home. You're wondering how you're going to pay your electric bill, your gas bill, your mortgage, your food, your, for that matter. And then you guys, those a reptilious, infected, religious fanatic asking you and hoping that you will give them money. You know, when the reptilians created all religion at the beginning of it all, 875 different denominations so far, I think they, they understood the word use and abuse and greed. You got a full example. If that is not shocking, I don't know what is shocking, but it's part of the news and it's part of my keywords. A police officer was fatally shot and two other officers wounded in San Marcos, Texas. That's why we are moving now into this SOS plutonic deadly window. Be careful if you're a cop. This is not normal. For years, I have tried to reach the police to educate them. And the technology is available in their trooper. They have a computer. They can use my software. Remember, I'm not a psychic. I don't predict anything. I just read the stars. So I can tell you, and it's, it can be scientifically proven, not only the perfect timing for earthquake at or above 6.0, but also what's happening with the cops, with killers. Pluto rules the uh, criminal elements. So more than ever, the reptilians are going to activate those people. And then you're going to have all sorts of drama, death and suicide and secret and God knows what. It's on. Be careful what you say. Be careful what you do, my friend. For whatever you say or whatever you do, we follow you for the rest of your life. This is very serious. What else do we have? China, stunningly. I, 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 I wrote the word stunning. China stunningly calls for end to blame games as lawsuits of a virus grows. What else that uh, means a surprise? Did you get a surprise lately? I explained yesterday what type of surprise I had with this guy that got stuck uh, with his uh, rider truck uh, putting his car. I explained all that yesterday if you watched the video. Well, guess what? Click on the link and see this humongous glacier that will crush in front of those people. Do you think those guys were actually expecting this monster, monster glacier, this pack of ice to up a sudden break in front of them. This is what you get when you have a uranic window, not a plutonic window that we are in moving now, but a uranic window. Anything and everything can happen. And if this negative window connects with your personal window, bye-bye, you did. What is really, really shocking that enunciate uh, the end of the shocking news and the beginning of the deadly plutonic news. YouTube talking kitty cat Steve Cash, which is the title of this newsletter, is dead. He killed himself. That's shocking. And it shows again that during a Plutonic window of the reptilians having a lot of fun reaching the weakest member of our society. They are using the UCI. They are using the stars of these people. Now you will get the same chart in the newsletter. Okay. So if you want to understand what I'm going to be talking about, uh, once you have uh, heard me and it's time for you to click on the link, you're going to see this chart and you can follow me better. So again, all the details will be for our VIP, for our Patreon supporter. They have to show their real support. So they're going to get all the details, but I'm going to give you the basics. First of all, Steve Cash was born in December. I don't know how many of you have purchased their 2019 or 2020 North Dakota Miss Dragon forecast, but I warn you, those born in December are going to be the prime target of the reptilians. It is not an accident. 
for cash to be born in December. Remember, my friends, there are no accidents, only cosmic circumstances at work that the majority of you cannot assimilate, cannot understand, and even though may even refuse because it's too frightful. But the reality is there. He was born in December. But that's not the only thing. Understand that Sagittarius rules the animal world, the pet world. Okay, the tail of the dragon is currently in Sagittarius, or very moving there very soon. If you get your book, you get to know all the details. Okay, but not only those born in December, those born in June, those born in January, and those born in July are target of this dragon. Doesn't mean you're gonna die, doesn't mean you're gonna get coronavirus. That is, if you know what to do and not to do, if you're prepared. If you read everything, remember knowledge is power, ignorance is evil. If you see the red light in the street or the stop sign in the street and you say, oh, forget it. And you cross, the, you cross, you might get killed. You're playing Russian roulette. Well, because you do not know, or because you haven't been taught, doesn't mean that the lights in the universe are always green. I know when those lights are going to turn green or red for you. I know when it's time for you to go and sign a contract, to get married, to play the lottery, you do whatever you want that you can be protected and be progressive. Okay. And also know when you're, you know, playing Russian roulette. Remember, God created the stars and the heavens for more than the sake of beauty, my friend. He gave them to us for interpretation so that we may lead a safer, more productive lives. Okay, you heard me before if you're, if you're not a newcomer. So Sagittarius was the pet world and you wonder why he likes cats and dogs and he's a Sagittarius. Oh, you don't know about Sagittarius? Go to drtheory.com and another tab, click, click on your sign. Click in Sagittarius, Gemini, Cancer, Scorpio. Read the basics of astropsychology as far as you're concerned. And when you read Sagittarius, you will see that this sign was the pet world. That's why it was easy for me when I was on coast to coast last October to tell George this tale of the dragon is going to kill uh, millions of animals and we're going to have a lot of fire. And two weeks later, you read the news, Australia suffered the biggest wildfire ever and lost millions of animals. Hello. What else do we have? The tale of the dragon. His tail of the dragon is in the fourth house. Fourth house is home. It's ruled by cancer. So it was, he had the tail of the dragon in his home. He can't stay home. The reptilians use technology. They use the internet. They use YouTube. He was a master. He spent hours and hours and hours and months and months, if not years, um, at home, right on his dragon stair. He was an easy target for the reptilians who infiltrated his body, his mind, and his soul through technology. And at the end, boom. Do you get it? That's real divine astrology. This is no number trying six out degree and bull that confuses you because you're looking at a detail and you're missing the entire pictures. Remember, there is more power in the location of your dragon alone than the entire complexity of your chart. I, I wrote a 600 page on the power of the dragon. How many of you are going to be curious or smart enough to put your hand on my book and look at your dragon's promises? In fact, your awareness, understanding, and respect of your natal or hidden dragon can only become a major contribution for your success or your failure in this lifetime. And you saw it, and I show it to you mathematically. You see, tail of the dragon in his home in Pisces. Pisces is what? Imagination. Pisces is creativity, extraordinarily creative. He was very spiritual. He loves everything, cats and, and dogs. He wants to help people. But he was not cosmic conscious, so he get more depressed, more depressed. And that is not going to tell you. And his wife, poor, poor, he won't tell you, okay? He took drugs. I'm not saying he smoked pot but he probably took legal drugs to battle 
this nightmare and that confused him a million times more and opened the wide door of madness and is gone. Look at his career. The head of the dragon is in his 10th house of career. You see that? Jupiter, the lord of luck and expansion. Saturn, uh, Saturn, the dedication structure. Mars, the drive principle to succeed. The head of the dragon, blessing his career. And then look at that, you see? The black moon. How many of you knows about the power of the black moon anywhere in your chart? Oh my God. Black moon. This is another open door to the reptiles to get to you through your career. But how do you turn the black moon into a white moon? That's what I do. That's what I did this morning. This is what I did yesterday. This is what I do each time I come back because I'm loaded with consultation and educate people on their black moon. Wherever this black moon is, if you leave it black, is going to consume you into the world of Pluto, the world of drama, death, the underworld, the area where the reptilians reign supreme. Now, you can ask your astrology, what is the black moon? They're going to tell you all sorts of things, but you're going to get the real thing with me. Find out where is your black moon. Find out where is your needle or hidden dragon, my friends, so that you don't have to you know, die a premature death like he did. Well, you know what? The tail of the dragon in Pisces is one of the most difficult, one of the most uh, elusive, one of the most complex and complicated location you can have over the dragon. There is two fishes, one swimming upstream towards God's cosmic design, Einstein, Michelangelo, George Washington, Dr. Terry. Pisces, swimming towards God's feet, understanding the cosmic code, his cosmic design, translate the information physically or spiritually and give it to you. The negative fish, the one who swims downstream, okay? Deception, illusion, drugs, alcohol, religion, again, I repeat myself, Joel Osteen, Pisces, going downhill, Osama bin Laden, a Pisces swimming downstream and leading a bunch of people to death because of his lunatic religious poisoning induced and imposed by the reptilians who put him in charge in a position of power to bring more idiotic human lost souls in the hell, in the hell they created themselves. My friends, there are no accidents. That's why building cosmic consciousness is the only way we're going to save ourselves and our planet and get rid of those entities that are cursing our solar system. There is a link also to sign my petition. I'm going to thank you. I was hoping to have 100 people. We were past 100. Let's keep it up. Okay. It's okay to watch your little beautiful cats out there and a beautiful man, which is so concerned to... Uh, to make your life better and to amuse your children. He's viral. He got millions of millions of you. Don't you think my work that can save his life, your life and the one of your children should be viral instead? But that's how it is. This is how the reptilians are running the show. That's why I only have you to help me so I can reach more people like him so that they don't commit suicides. They don't let the reptilians poison their body, their mind, and their soul by digging on their tail of the dragon instead of reaching the head and being happy, wealthy, healthy ever after. Remember, knowledge is power. Ignorance is evil, my friends. All right, so I'm going to be probably going again. I'm leaving tomorrow. I wish I'd be home and, you know, take care of all my clients from all over the world that are constantly asking me for guidance uh, and, you know, regenerate their spirit. But I am needed now. You know, this is, this is a war. This is a war. And uh, the qualification that I have, uh, I took my CDL license. I revived it. I took my asthma to double, triple. So it's, 
you know, there's a lot of people uh, that are in need and no enough driver, plenty, plenty work, plenty, plenty loads to deliver to the East Coast, to New York, to Rhode Island, to Pennsylvania. All those states are desperately in need of material tools, instrumentation, um, anything and everything that can help to beat the virus and save life. So knowing that I have this uh, uh, education, those skills that are badly needed, I decide to go out there. And then don't be, don't be worried about me. I, I have my food. I stayed in the truck. I just get out of the truck just to feed it up. Um, or if I run out of coffee, come in and out. And I do wear my mask. I do have gloves when I fill up, you know, uh, gas tanks. So, you know, uh, don't worry about me. I don't need your negative thoughts. <laughs> I am lucky. I know what's going on. I have no fear and I'm smart enough to, to avoid this. Um, so I'm going to be leaving tomorrow. Um, maybe I make a little video and put it on YouTube or on Facebook. I'm not sure. But I will keep you posted. I will make another video when I come back. So let me finish by saying one more time. Um, this, uh, the window that we are in now for the next few days is a plutonic deadly window. It is the golden gate of the reptilians that are going to create a lot of damage. And what you saw with this suicide of this crazy lunatic in Canada killing people is just the beginning. So one more time, be careful what you do. What you say, where you go. Join the Cosmic Code, join Patreon, and read the rest of the story that we give you exactly what to do and not to do in order to benefit from this window. Remember, every single planet and every single sign is positive and negative. All you got to do is understand the positive and the negative. Remember, up and down, black and white, the front, the back, got the ball, the yin and yang, two eyes, two arms, two legs, two sides of the brain, the reptilian's brain, the draconis brain. All right, you understand all that? All right, so you can still use any negative window at your advantage if you know. That's what the black moon is all about. It's all black, it's all dark, it's all negative, it's all fear, it's all a lack of wisdom, criticism, skepticism, atheism, racism, it's all there. We need to turn all this white, love and light. All right, my good friend, we'll talk to you again some other time. God bless you. Be safe out there, okay? Goodbye.